Now, you all know how much I babble on about Crossy Road, right? What? You know, the game with the chicken, where you have to cross a road? Well, now we have the crossing of the dead. That's right. Zombies are still ruling this world, and you still have to avoid the bastards. So I hear you ask, what is the difference between crossing of the dead and crossing road? There is no difference at all. But if anything, this is slightly cooler, right? So you're dealing with zombies again. Don't we like dealing with zombies? We clearly love them at the moment. With, uh, well, put it this way, Resident Evil's been around for a long time. That's zombies. There's been Dawn of the Dead films for years. We obviously have Walking Dead. Everyone loves Walking Dead. I know I definitely do. Um, so it's essentially... It's our Achilles heel at the moment, isn't it, zombies? So obviously what you have to do is avoid the zombies. Essentially a frogger clone. So what you have to do is make your way to the top of the map. I'm pretty sure the map is... Well, let's face it. You don't have to get to a certain point. I think it's endless and you can go as far as you want. I think the maps aren't. 100% randomly generated, if you see what I mean. Um, so there obviously is an end point at some point, but I think it goes a very, very long way. And it does get very hard anyway, so I can't imagine you're ever going to get to complete this, unless you put a lot of time into it. So, obviously you have zombies, you have to avoid those, but along the way, you can pick up weapons. So you have... Pistols, shotguns, machine guns, bazookas. Yes, that's right, bazookas. So you can actually blow them to smithereens. But as well as that, you have coins. So as you collect the coins, what you do is you buy uh, extra items. And what can you do with those extra items? As you can see right here, you can buy a chainsaw, you can buy weaponry, you can upgrade things, um, as well as these, not loot crates, I'm not sure they're called loot crates anyway, um, but these crates where you basically get a random item in it. So you're essentially gambling. Um, it's called loot rates, yes, the loot crates, I thought it was. So as you can see, it cost 80 coins, I got 50 out of it. As you're about to see again, I'll do it again, and I'll lose again. So, most of the time, you don't really get a lot from these. So I'd probably advise using the other power-ups or other weaponry if you want to get some more power-ups. Uh, or, sorry, a better weaponry, a better arsenal to take down those zombies. Because at the end of the day, they are, are an annoyance, and it is easier just to uh, shoot the fuckers. And they are pretty stupid, as you just saw. They walk into cars. Yeah, they are that stupid. So, along the way, because everything's destroyed anyway, you've got to avoid everything else, like fires, buildings falling down, electrical pylons, which will electrify you. Make sure you avoid those. And that's really it. That's the game in a nutshell. You just have to make your way up and uh, get as far as you can. Your, your score will be in the top left-hand side of the uh, screen. Top right-hand side of the screen is the amount of coins. So that's where you'll be able to, like I said, you'll use that as your currency to upgrade your weapons, etc. Or speed up the movement of your uh, little guy. I don't, what should we call him? Should we call him Rick Grimes? That works. Let's call him Rick Grimes. Anyway, call him what you want. Little block man. Um, that's what we'll call him. Minecraft ripoff. How about that? Yeah? We all agree with that? Um, so, obviously, the goal of the game is literally just to get as far as you can, get high up onto the scoreboard. There's, as far as I'm aware, there's no ending to this. It is continuous. Um, but it's a bit of fun. And it doesn't really cost... It, it was free. So, if you love zombies, and you love everything zombie at the moment, like most of us do, let's face it, and you've got 5-10 minutes to spare every now and again, this is a good game just to sort of melt the time away. Anyway, I 100% recommend this. Do play it. Tell me what you think. <laughs>